The latest weapon in the fight against aquatic invasive species is a zebra mussel sniffing dog. Lake, Lake Advocates attended a two-day AIS summit in St. Cloud this week to learn more about that and the current condition of Minnesota lakes. Our Logan Gay has more. With several more lakes this summer being identified as having aquatic invasive species, many are wondering if the problem is getting better. The AIS might be getting worse. Uh, we had the starry stonewort come in and that was first found in Coronas last year and now it's in, I believe, six more lakes. Uh, but it might be getting better because if you look at the trend lines, the rate of infestation seems to be bending. So I think that all this recent activity is having an impact. Um, and the response to the starry stonewort has been more aggressive. The infestations are not only affecting the lakes, but also the land. There's a, an assessor who estimated a $31 million drop in property tax values in Mille Lacs County uh, following the walleye crash. Some believe that the worst is yet to come if they don't get a handle on the issue. You know, you look at some of the southern lakes where there's, uh, you know, hydrilla, which is, it's, it's called eutrophication, which is a process of basically filling in the lake. You know, shallow lakes become meadows. And to better fight aquatic invasive species, law enforcement have enlisted the help of a furry friend. We, what we have here is a boat and uh, Officer Seams about 15 minutes ago hid uh, zebra mussels on the boat. So she's going to show us how she details the boat with, with uh, Brady and Brady's going to find those zebra mussels for us and show us where they're at. Dogs like Brady are the future of keeping our lakes clean and healthy. It's a collaborative effort, you know, between uh, lake associations, the DNR, the sheriff's office, and, and the public just to try to, to slow down and stop the spread of invasives. Brady's just another tool in our toolbox to be able to do that, and uh, he does a good job. In St. Cloud, Logan Gay, Lakeland News. You can contact the DNR Enforcement Division if, ne if you need the services of the AIS sniffing dog. The, na the name of that dog is Brady. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.